Well, after Governor Greg Abbott of Texas finally grew some balls and decided to put razor wire on his border to defend against innovation, which of course it is, America, yeah! both the feds and the Supreme Court have stepped in and says, well, you can't do that. What? And it's got to come down. What the Abbott's response? I don't give a fuck. It's staying up. I'm Jazz Bergonzo on this. Go fuck yourself. It's what's next. Hey, what's up, everyone? Jazz Gonzo, what's an extra daily dose? Hope you guys are feeling good today on this Thursday. Well, this uh, story should have got a lot more play than it did, but still, nonetheless, it's very important. Recently, we go to Texas, where Governor Greg Abbott finally said enough is enough. After calling out a declaration of an invasion, which, of course, it is, seven and a half million, I'm sorry, pushing eight million illegals have fled into the border in the last three plus years under Joe Dementia, Abbott said enough is enough. He decided to put razor wire along the border of the Rio Grande. And so, of course, he was going to have the National Guard there as well to defend it. But recently, the feds and the Supreme Court have stepped in and said, yeah, you need to take that down. We've got a problem with it. Abbott's response says, Fuck you, it's staying up. What are you going to do about it? And here we go. This comes out of Breitbart. Border shutdown. Texas defies feds. We will continue to, I'm sorry, we will continue to deploy razor wire. And of course, you can see dementia there. You know, he's all happy, isn't he? The Texas military department says it will continue to hold the line in Shelby Park in their efforts to deter and prevent unlawful entry into the state of Texas, a.k.a illegals under the operation lone star orders from governor greg abbott the texas national guard actions continue despite a second demand letter from the d uh, from the doh department of homeland security to release the control of the park seized by state earlier this month governor greg abbott pledged to um, continue to deploy razor wire along the rio grande border with mexico quote we remain resolute in our actions to secure our border preserve the rule of law and protect the sovereignty of our state he wrote this was, I'm sorry, this was the Texas Military Department. Shortly after the DHS officials uh, issued a second letter to Texas Attorney General Ken Paxton demanding access uh, to Shelby Park in Eagle Pass, a defiant Governor Greg Abbott posted, we will continue to deploy this razor wire to repel illegal immigration. As you can see, the National Guard installing. Photos posted on X show guardsmen with riot shields standing along the installed razor wire to keep migrants, aka illegals again, from crossing and illegally entering Texas. Good for them. On Monday, the Supreme Court reversed a temporary restraining order by the U.S. Court of Appeals for the Fifth Circuit, allowing uh, the U.S. Border Patrol agents to cut or remove razor wire, razor wire excuse me, installed by the Texas Military Department along the banks of the Rio Grande. Shortly after, Abbott announced, this is not over. Texas razor wire is an effective deterrent for illegal crossings and Biden encourages. CBS News, Camilo Montoya Galvez posted a video from Shelby Park on Tuesday showing guardsmen continue to construct additional fencing and razor wire. Nice. My thoughts. It's defiance. It's defiance done the right way. You know, not through violence, not through not through stupidity, not through ignorance, but just defiance in the way of defending their state. And congrats to uh, Governor Greg Abbott. I mean, this was a guy who basically was ballless for a number of years in regards to defending Texas border. When he put out the declaration of invasion, uh, it was maybe summer of last year, a lot of people looked at it as like, great. Finally, Texas is going to be Texas. Texas is going to have the balls. They're going to step up. They're going to take care of business. They're going to do what they have to do to defend their state uh, from illegal invasion, not just from Mexicans, but from all over. And nothing happened. Then in the last month or so, Abbott said, you know what? Enough is enough. Start, you know, installing the razor wire. And they did. They went up and down. They went down to Shelby Park and, of course, up and down the Rio Grande. Which I don't see I have a problem with it. I don't see a problem with any state defending their sovereignty. It's not just the United States as a whole that's sovereign. Each individual state has their own sovereignty as well. 
to defend their state. The governor takes the same oath as the president to defend against all uh, enemies, domestic and foreign. They take the same oath, every single governor. Now, of course, you have governors who actually have balls enough to do what they have to do to defend their state. And then you have others like uh, Gavin Newsom, who just doesn't give two fucks. All eagles, come on in. We're broke ass. We don't care. But uh, between the hundreds of millions of dollars that have been sucked off the teats of the state of Texas, and of course, the just influx of illegals, it's just, in, it's out of control. It's insane. And Biden, you know, dementia boy, doesn't give two fucks. He don't care. Because he sees his, every illegal who passes is another vote for Democrats. And that's a fact. They don't care about their, uh, you know, welfare. They don't care about, you know, for every one illegal who crosses and says, you know what, we're, 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 we're here to come to the United States to bring our families, you know, you know, to, to live the American dream. You have five to 10 who are crossing over to do some sort of shenanigans, i.e. violence, name it. And of course, they have no problem claiming it. But at the end of the day, good for Governor Greg Abbott for standing up to his oath to defend his borders against all enemies. Of course, currently, they all happen to be foreign and illegal. And with that being said, I'm Jazz Gonzo. This is What's Next. Want to see more like this? Please leave a comment below. Like it, share it, subscribe to it, hit the notification bell. Cont notification bell, excuse me. Uh, continue to spread the word about the show. Help the show continue to grow. And we'll see you next time. Peace.